So now I want to co create a new PHP document. I'll just get rid of this and we're going to save this file inside of the Gumby WordPress directory that we created for our theme. And I'm going to name this header.php. And now I'll access the snippets. You'll notice that I named the folder Gumby WordPress. And inside you will find a folder called theme structure. And right here we're working on the header.php file. And we're going to be populating the head first. I have provided two different versions where there are the elements individually. So this is all of the meta. You can piece together your head code individually using uh, the elements, or you can simply use the full group. Uh, <clears throat> and so pop that in. And so now we have everything that we need for the head region. So now let's move on and create the index.php file. And also, let's go ahead and create our footer. Okay. And then we'll use the full Gumby footer. Now, you'll notice inside of here, um, I didn't break it up the same way I did the head. And it's because any of this stuff that you don't want, you can, uh, you can just uh, remove it. <clears throat> um, basically, they're just the uh, they're the JavaScript files for um, the UE, and then also um, we have our WP footer detect right here. Um, and so, if you're not using all of the UE elements, you can remove um, any of the elements that you did not choose to download. So I'll save that. Okay, so now we have our header that contains the all of the code that we need for the head of our doc, HTML document. And then we also have the footer. And so the next thing that we want to do is move the style sheet around. So inside of the Gumby framework, you'll find the style.css file inside of the CSS directory. I'm just going to scoot that up. and open and the snippet that we're going to use for this one is under the style.css theme style sheet and you'll change these values to whatever your theme's name is of course um, <clears throat> okay and that's all I'm going to update for this one and so finally the last thing that we need to do um, in order to set our foundation is let's bring all of these together using the index.php and so at the top I'm going to call the header you'll find these under the common WordPress and I'll get header and then I'll get the footer And you can feel free to get rid of the comments. These are only here for training purposes. They are not required. Inside in between these is where we're going to begin building our layout structure. So for right now, let's go ahead and upload the files to the server. And here we have it. This is the Gumby WordPress. I'll go ahead and activate and refresh. And there we have it. So now we have a blank white canvas. 
that is ready for us to begin building our layout.